The following presentation is a helpful integrated video to help you navigate our facility and understand our rules. Welcome to the Island Action Sports Complex. As you enter and exit the facility, please take extra care when merging with traffic on and off the Pacific Highway. Please take your time to enjoy the drive into the facility and don't rush. Signs are posted along the road informing you of speed limits and wildlife you may encounter. All surrounding properties are full-time cattle stations, so please give way to any cattle you may encounter on your drive into the facility. The road features sections where one vehicle is permitted at a time. Please follow traffic signs as posted. As you drive through the main entrance, please keep right to access our head office to see our friendly staff and have your rider documents signed. Your photo will be taken, your very own ID card issued, and your payments will be made. Our friendly staff will issue you with a map and rules to help you guide you around the facility. Please never hesitate to ask our staff for any information you require. We have many car parks across the facility. Our top car park is dedicated for expert riders who are attending our main track. We have family car parks surrounding our main complex and others across the bridge. Both family car parks have access to all tracks. Please be aware that red and green signs are posted in laneways and car parks around the facility. Red signs mean slow zones, idle speed, while green signs mean normal ride speed. Our facility has great family picnic tables, male and female amenities, first aid station, a full cafe and our merchandise store. Staff are here to help and make your day enjoyable. Our staff are busy riding around on ATVs and UTVs. Please ask if you need any information or assistance. In the event of a track emergency, staff will be on track with UTVs under flashing lights. Tracks under these conditions will mean slow down and no jumping. Our tracks are routinely maintained and watered. So please exit the track when you see the water truck or other equipment entering the track area. Staff, however, are also ensuring everyone complies with our rules and insurance policy. Please ensure you ride to your ability or your safety gear is worn Staff are issued with a hole punch. If you're found in breach of the rules, riding tracks above your skill level, or for example, riding with no helmet, your card will be punched. Please do not cross jump on any tracks. Remember to stay on the same side. This is to keep all riders safe. Three hole punches in your card will ban you from the facility for 12 months. So please ensure you follow all the rules and signs as posted around the facility. During your visit, you'll notice that signs declaring that the facility and surrounding properties are monitored by 24-hour wireless camera security systems. This is to ensure the safety of the facility, attendees, and our staff. We have all types of tracks and training grounds to build your skill level across the facility, and are expanding our facility during Stage 2 to accommodate even more. Facility rules are as follows. Dangerous driving on the entrance road will not be tolerated and security cameras are in operation. Abusive or aggressive behaviour towards staff and other attendees will not be tolerated. All safety equipment must be worn while riding. This includes boots, pants, jersey, helmet, goggles and gloves. Any pollution, for example, fuels, Oils, rubbish, discarded on the ground, will not be tolerated. Do not damage park property. We reserve the right to refuse anyone entry. Speed limits are heavily enforced, both on our roads and our laneways. No foot traffic is permitted on our tracks. All signs posted must be obeyed. 
A full list of our rules will be located on your facility map that is available at our HQ. The Island Action Sports Complex is located in one of the most amazing tourist destinations in New South Wales. We advise everyone attending our facility and interacting with the region to please respect us, respect the community, respect the environment and please support our local businesses. We all want the facility to become a significant part of the community for generations to come and we can only do this with your help. Thank you for watching the Rider Briefing video. We hope you enjoy the ride.